is News Channel 5. I think uh, the family would just like to get the doors back. A local family is disgusted tonight after what happened to a Norwalk mausoleum that sat untouched since the 1930s. Good evening, I'm Sarah Buddison, in for Lee Jordan tonight. And I'm Chris Flanagan. Police say someone sold the doors to the mausoleum right before Christmas. News Channel 5's Dave Arnold talked to the family and officers trying to figure out who's behind it all. It is new at 6 tonight. There was a cross on each door with some scroll work. Remembering lost loved ones on holidays at a cemetery is something many of us honor. Some with seasonal flowers, some with metal ornaments stationed by the family's graves commemorating their services to the public. But for Christmas scrap thieves, apparently without honor, cemeteries are merely opportunities. There's two doors missing off one mausoleum. They're about 84 inches in height. Norwalk police had to make a call the day after Christmas to one resident that one or more thieves had made off with two heavy bronze doors from their family mausoleum. Doors to one family's history now hidden with only plywood. Some of these people have no threshold for uh, respect or anything. And it's, it's uh, amazing it happens in a cemetery of all places. Fritz, the fireman, is up on the right. His wife, Emma, is straight across from him. The relative who maintains this mausoleum wanted to remain anonymous, but was kind enough to show me what was behind the heavy bronze doors. Doors similar to these on a nearby mausoleum. The windows were taken off first, then someone crawled in, removing their hardware. You know, you always thought they were secure. You never gave it a second thought that they'd come up missing. Does it shock you? Well... That's the way things are these days. There's no respect for things. Friends and family are hoping that these will at least respect a no questions asked reward. Well, my hope is just whoever uh, took them off is to think about us and put them someplace, call someone, tell them where they are, and we've offered a $500 reward for the safe return of the doors. On your side, Norwalk, Dave Arnold, News Channel 5. Norwalk police are hoping someone saw the thieves removing the doors Christmas Eve or the day before, perhaps thinking they may have been real cemetery workers. If you have any information, you're asked to contact Norwalk police.